Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Hello, can you hear me? Good evening. Good evening. I can see Jose Samuel right now. Samuel, ¿cómo me escucha, Samuel? No class, it's really nice to see you today. It's Monday again. Wow. Time really flies. Vuela muy rápido el tiempo. Se nos va muy rápido. Okay. But tell me, how was your weekend? How was your weekend? Was it good? What did you do? ¿Qué hicieron en el weekend? Did you go out with your family? What did you do? What Working, else? Class. Working, Working classes. Class. Really? Okay. How about Katia, Marvin, Jaime? What did you do? ¿Qué hicieron, chicas? Speaking time. Vamos, cambiamos ya el chip de inglés. What did you do? ¿Qué hicieron? Playing the soccer. Okay, playing soccer. Really? Excellent. What else? What did you do? ¿Qué hicieron? Read a book. Uh, wash my clothes. Clean my house. <laughs> okay, to clean house. To clean the house, right? So... How do you say wash my clothes? ¿Cómo decimos eso en inglés? Chicos, wash my clothes. Hay una forma que decimos. No decimos en sí wash my clothes. Eso sería un poco literal. ¿Alguien recuerda qué, qué otra forma tenemos para decir wash? Do the laundry. Exactly. Mejor digamos do the laundry. Okay? Do the laundry. Me encanta. Okay? So, we are going to start with the class right now. Si me escuchan bien, pues no vamos a utilizar mi iPad. Vamos a quedarnos con este nada más. Ok. So, class. Eh, don't forget to have your cameras on. If you have problems with your camera, just let me know. Ok. Text me. Escríbanme el chat. Teacher, por tal razón ahorita no puedo encender la cámara, pero luego la enciendo. Ok. Escribamos nombre completo. Full name. Ok. Your full name. Nombre completo para ver eh, de pasar la asistencia y que esté pues en este caso que esté completo su nombre okay? full name full name so do you remember the topic we were talking about what topic qué topic estábamos viendo last week quién se acuerda what was the topic yes Simple present, present yes. and WH question. And WH questions. You know, today we are going to continue with WH. También la vamos a ver. Es muy importante WH questions, okay? So, we are going to start with the class right now. Thank you so much for coming to this class. Who can tell me the date? What day is it today? Yeah. March 21. Okay. Today is Monday, March okay. 21, 21st, 2022. Exactly. 21st, 21st. Today is March 21st. Or Monday, March 21st. We are about to finish this month. Casi terminamos un nuevo mes. Okay, clase. Así que vamos muy bien. Did you complete section one and section two? Did you, did you finish with the activities? Yes? Yes. Do still have questions? Yes. 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 Okay, I'm really glad to hear that. So we can continue with section number three today. Okay, section number three. Here we go. Cameras on, please. Gabby, Saira, Stacy, Carlos, I guess Kelly is having problems. <laughs> So, look, okay, we're going to start with section number three today. And in section three, we have the topic, what do you do? What do you do? What do you do? This is 
when you want to know about people's professions or occupation. What do you do? <clears throat> what do you do? For example, in my case, if you ask me, hey, what do you do? I am a teacher. I work as a teacher. Okay. I'm a teacher. I work as a teacher. Okay. So what do you do? That is the topic for this um, section. Okay. Section number three. And we are going to cover there is, there are. That is one of the topics for this lesson. Don't forget that this is session number five. Ya vamos con la sesión número cinco. Muy rápido. Bien, my name. Algunos quizás no estuvieron el día de la clase, acaba al inicio. So, no recuerdan mi nombre, aquí estamos. Teacher Elena Argueta. Okay? And thank you so much. Hay algunos que ya me escribieron en el chat solicitando ayuda. Gracias, en serio, por la confianza. Y ya estamos para ayudar, chicos. Okay? So, what do you do? What do you do? So, what are we going to do? Let's go and check the platform. Let's see what we have. Section number three, what do you do? And here we are. Okay, right now I want you to listen and read the information. Zaira me dice que tiene problemas con el audio. Okay, after this video, vamos a pasar la lista, okay? Y vamos clase. Here we go. Okay, jobs, vocabulary, and activities. Job, vocabulary, and activities. This is a really nice topic, okay? Because in real life, we are going to use this vocabulary a lot. Cuando conocemos gente nueva o interactuamos, es bien común que nosotros preguntemos por Jobs and occupations, okay? Entonces es bueno practicar el vocabulary, the pronunciation, and the WH questions, okay? So pay close attention to the video. And here we go. The first time, just listen. Then we are going to repeat, okay? Nine. Okay, me dicen si se escucha. Yes. 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 Excellent. Here we go. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn yes. vocabulary for common jobs. Additionally, you'll also practice describing the activities that different jobs do. Let's get started by listening and practicing the vocabulary. One. He's a receptionist. Two. She's a doctor. Receptionist. Three. She's a nurse. Four. He's a pilot. Five. She's a flight attendant. Six. He's a musician. Seven. She's a singer. Eight. She's a judge. Nine. He's a police officer. Ten. He's a lawyer. Eleven. He's a cook. He's a chef. Twelve. He's a waiter. Thirteen. She's a waitress. Fourteen. He's a salesperson. Fifteen. She's a cashier. Cashier. Sixteen. She's a security guard. Now, let me write some additional vocabulary, which we will use to make sentences which describe the activities that these different jobs do. Places, in a hospital, in an office, in a store, in a hotel. Activities, wears a uniform, sits all day, talks to people, works hard, Stands all day, handles money, works at night, writes 
tickets. Now we want to connect the job to places and activities. Let me make a couple of examples and then I would like for you to make your own. A doctor works in a hospital. Okay, look at this activity. This is place. A doctor works hard. This is an activity. A cashier works in a store. Cashier works in a store. This is a place. A cashier handles money. This is an activity. activity. Okay. Now, I would like for you to make examples with all the vocabulary words given. After you finish this activity, please share your work in our discussion forums. Okay, that was the video. So look, they were talking about vocabulary related to jobs and occupation jobs and occupation do you remember the vocabulary who can tell me five professions or works that remember can recuerda cinco cinco del vocabulario okay. Vamos atención. Okay. Go. cook police officers okay uh, security work um lawyer lawyer and josh Okay, who else? Thank you, thank you, Jancy. Who can remember the vocabulary? No? Do you want to watch it again? Yeah. Okay, go uh, ahead. Uh, cashier. Okay. Um, liar. Uh, chef. Chef. Um, y no recuerdo qué más. <laughs> Don't worry, don't you worry, okay? Let's again, but let me see. Let me share the audio. Time we are going to repeat, okay? Let's repeat. Here we go. Additionally, you'll also practice describing the activities that different jobs do. Let's get started by listening and practicing the vocabulary. Okay, let's One. practice. He's a receptionist. Okay, class. Receptionist. Now you, receptionist. 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 Ah, exactly. Where can you find a receptionist? Where can you find a receptionist? In a hospital. Okay. Or in a hotel. In a hotel. Hmm? In a hospital. In the cinema. No. In an office too. Yeah. In an office, okay, receptionist. A clinic. Exactly. Uh, okay. What do they do? What are the activities that receptionists do? What do they do? ¿Qué actividades hacen los receptionists? Recepcion document. Okay. Uh, Recepción de documentos, ¿verdad? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Receive to get documentation. Yes, Carmen. Um, yes. Attending people. Okay. Saying hi to people. Welcome. How can I help you? Okay. Reception. Oriental okay. person. Greeting people. Very good job. Two. She's a doctor. Okay. She's a doctor. That is easy for you. Doctor. She's a doctor. Where can we find doctors? Where can we find doctors, class? In a hospital. In a hospital. In a clinic. At a hospital. Clinic. Clinic. Okay. Clinic. Okay. Clinic. Uh -huh. Where, yes, and then I was exactly doctor. So, this word it can be used for both. Okay, puede usar para ambos: doctor, para mujer y para hombre. Okay, doctor and doctor. En español, si hacemos la diferencia marcada, en the same. 
How about receptionist? Bless you. Salud, bless you. Salud, <laughs> le dijeron. <laughs> and doctor. Receptionist and doctor. Okay, here we go. Three. She's a nurse. She is a nurse. She is a nurse. Nurse. Where can you find nurses? The hospital, the hospital clinics, nurse. Okay. En el seguro. Okay. En el seguro social, exactly. Nurse. Yeah. Are nurses nice or no? Here in El Salvador, are they nice people or not really? Both. Your opinion. Okay. Yeah. Right. Both. Right. Yes, they are. You know. Today I had to spend all day at the hospital with my son. Me tocó pasar todo el día en el hospital con mi baby, with my baby, I have a son. So, they were nice. Fueron muy, muy amables, en serio. No sé qué pasó, pero muy amables. Así que, para mi opinión, today, they were really nice. Really nice people. But, on the other hand, there are some people who say, no, they are really mad people. Siempre están en los house. ¿Qué piensan ustedes? Yes, right? Sometimes. Maybe not all of them. Not todo, ¿verdad? Siempre hay una excepción. So, let's continue. Four. He's a pilot. He is a pilot. Pilot. Where do they work? Where do pilots work? In the airplane. Mm -hmm. In the airplane. How In the airplane. Airport, airport, at the airport, excellent. Or they plane an airplane. Five, she's a flight attendant. Flight attendant, flight attendant. Flight. This is aeromosa. Aeromosa, muy Flight, vuelo, attendant, como ayudante. Six, he's a musician. Seven. Musician, musician, okay, musician. What do they do? In this case, look at the picture. Musician, what is he playing? The piano. He's, He's playing, playing the piano. He's playing the piano. So he is a musician. Seven. She's a singer. Singer. Eight. She's a judge. Singer. Singer, can you mention singer. famous singers around the world? Singers, can you mention singers around the world? Singers, cantantes, yes. singers. Tell me the name of a famous singer around the world. Madonna. Yeah, Madonna is a famous a singer. Ariana Dua Lipa. Dua Lipa is a famous singer. Ariana Grande. Yes, Ariana Grande. Justin yes, Bieber. Catherine. Justin Bieber Eminem. is a famous singer. Who? Oh, Eminem. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, he's yes. a really famous singer. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So Eminem, there you go. So singer, that is a profession as well. It's a job. It's an occupation. Are you a singer? class? Do I have singers in this class? No? Maybe. No? No tenemos cantantes, solo en el baño cantamos. Yeah. Yes. Nine. <laughs> He's a police officer. Ah, let's go back. Judge. Judge. Look at this. This one. Let's go back. Judge. What is a judge? Judge. Wait. He's a police okay. officer. Wait. Police officer, that is very common. Police officer. What is another way to say police officer? <laughs> Policeman. Policeman. Mm -hmm. Police officer. Policeman. 10. He's a lawyer. Lawyer. 11. Lawyer. Do I have lawyers here in this class? Lawyers. Lawyers. Avogados. Lawyers. No lawyers in this class? Or maybe in your family? Or a friend? 
Student. Yes, I am a lawyer. Okay, Amilcar is a lawyer? Yeah. Okay, so listen, we have a lawyer in the class. Excellent, lawyer, un abogado, abogado, lawyer, excellent. Let's continue. He's a cook, he's a chef. Okay, cook, cook, or? Chef. chef. Very good. She is a cook, he is a cook, or she is a chef, or he is a chef. Cook and chef, synonyms. 12, he's a waiter. 13, she's a waitress. Okay, waiter, waitress, waiter, waitress. Camarero. What is it? Exactly. Very good. If you go to a restaurant, let's say a pollo campero, there you're going to find waiters and waitress. Is the same, but in this case, we use a word for women and we use another word for men. Hacemos la distinción. Si se fijaron, hay palabras que las usamos para ambos, hombres y mujeres. Pero en este caso hacemos una distinción, ¿ok? ¿Sí? Waiter, it's for. ¿Para quién es waiter? Men. Men. Waitress. Y for. Women. Female. Uh -huh. Ok, female or women. Very good. Waitress. 14. He's a salesperson. 15. She's a cashier. Okay, sales person. Sales person. Where do you find sales people? Mm -hmm. In the store. Sales person. Okay, what is the difference between this one? Sales. Wait. Let's put another color. Black and make it bigger. Yes, class, where can we find sales people or a sales person? In a store. So what is the difference between sales person and vendor? ¿Han escuchado estas? Vendor. Yes. ¿Cuál es la diferencia entonces? Sales person, vendor. What is the difference? And try to say that in English, okay? This is a question for you. Where can we find salespersons and vendors? Where can we find them? Any idea? For example, if I go to buy a car, I want to buy a car. Who? is going to sell me a car, the salesperson or the vendor? The vendor. Mm -hmm. I don't know. You don't know? Any ideas? This is a speaking time. No tengan miedo de equivocarse. Quiero ver sus ideas. ¿Qué tanto sabemos de eso? Okay, the example is, I want to buy a car. Voy a una agencia, quiero comprar un carro. ¿Quién se encarga de promocionarme, decirme las ventajas? Las desventajas del carro, qué modelo necesito, qué colores tiene, quién lo hace. Él. Ah, ejecutivo de ventas. Ah, or in this case, person. salesperson. Si yo voy al mercado, quiero ir a comprar fruta y voy a un puesto en específico, ¿quién está atendiendo ahí? ¿El salesperson o el vendor? Vendor. Vendor. So what is the difference? Salesperson is in charge of selling. They need to sell. Salesperson necesita vender. He goes get clients. The vendor, clients come. Okay. ¿Sí entendieron la diferencia? ¿Sí está clara la diferencia, chicos? Sí, o sea, yes. es decir que va el sales, sales person 
Yes. Es como más formal, por ejemplo, si vamos a un mall o a comprar un auto algo así. Uh -huh. Y el vendedor ya es como algo informal. Por ejemplo, los que se suben a los buses son de vendor. Ah, ok, ok, vendor. ¿verdad? Ok, puede ah, ser formal y informal. Uh -huh. Pero quiero ese ejemplo, ok. Quien va y se rebusca por los clientes es el salesperson. Tengo que vender porque es mi trabajo, me pagan por vender. Y los vendedores puede ser ese tipo de personas, sí, me gusta eso de informal que los clientes tienen a ellos, ¿ok? Podemos encontrarlos ¿qué? en las tiendas, en el mercado, que ustedes van a buscarlos ellos, ¿ok? Vendors. ¿no? No, Esa es la diferencia. No, 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 Veamos en este imagen. Yes, they are vendors. Veamos, podemos reconocer acá, vendors, están en a store. Yes, but they are sales person. 16. She's a security guard. Security guard. Security guard. Where can you find a security guard? In a bank. In a bank, at a supermarket, supermarket. many places. If you go to a mall, a shopping mall, you can find a lot of security guards. Okay? Security guards. Excellent. Now, let me write some additional vocabulary. Okay, so can you mention some others? Do you know any other extra vocabulary? Yes, no? Extra vocabulary? Okay. Yes, tell me about jobs. ¿Cuáles no fueron mencionados? Mm -hmm. My example, I have some others here. And um, Bell, Bell Hub. Hub. Mm -hmm. From the square. Asher. Uh, I'll okay. I'll contain. Excellent. Accounting. Bell Hub. Cashier. Chair. Cashier. From the desk. From the desk. Okay. Letter F. Which ones do you recognize? For example, A. Accounting. ¿Qué hace el account? Contador. Ok, excellent job. Very good. He takes care of finances in, a, in, I don't know, any place. Ok. Bellhop. Bellhop. ¿Qué es eso? Bellhop. Any idea? Bellhop. Bell is campana. Ok. Hop. I don't know. And hop. Hop. Ah. Hip -hop. <laughs> Como el botón es. Ok, great idea. Me gusta esa asociación que hicieron. Bell. Bell. Ok, excellent. Hop. How about cashier? El botón. ¿Qué se le llama? Bell. Hop. Cashier. Cashier. Cajero. Cajero. Chef. It's clear, right? Cocinero. Doctor, easy, doctor. Front desk clerk. Where can you find a front desk clerk? Yes. Que está enfrente del escritorio del vendedor. Maybe no, it's not a vendor, but most of the time we call front desk clerk to people who is at a hotel. Los que están en el hotel, ¿ok? ¿Qué hacen ellos? Ellos no reciben llamadas o quizás sí. No cobran dinero, no. ¿Se encargan de qué? Atender a las personas. ¿sí? ¿El recepcionista? Recepcionista, exactamente. Solo que a veces a los recepcionistas les llamamos a aquellos que... ¿Qué hacen? Llamamos recepcionistas. Atienden llamadas, escriben emails. Es como un poco más, más de oficina el trabajo. Pero el front desk. Clerk. Um, it's people that, yeah, usually it is at, at a hotel. Estamos en el hotel, atendiendo, okay? Solo recibiendo, dando llave y todo, front desk. Host, a host. It's people who's coming, in this case, to a hotel. Host, mm -hmm. invitado, nurse, office manager, police officer, receptionist. Sales person, 
security guard, server, taxi driver, and vendor. So, let's make a pause here. Hagamos una pausa. Vamos a tomar la asistencia ahorita. Luego vamos a trabajar en grupos. Okay? Groups. So you can say hi to your classmates. Here we go. Let me see. If you listen to your name, say here or present. Vamos a tomar la asistencia ahorita, chicos. Give me a second. Wait. Here we go. Ocho a nueve. Aquí está. And don't forget class. Necesitamos completar las actividades de la plataforma. Okay. Ya les vamos a dar seguimiento. Quienes me aparecen acá que han completado. Y quienes aún no. Puede ser que tengamos problemas, ¿ok? Eh, si es así, con la plataforma tienen problemas en completar, díganmelo, para que no eh, vayamos atrasándonos con las actividades, ¿ok? Bien, Amílcar Elgardo. Present. Bernardo Antonio. Present, teacher. Carlos Manuel. Present. Carmen Guadalupe. Present, teacher. Excellent. Carmen Lisette. Present teacher. Excellent. Claudia Lisette. Present. Excellent. Delmi Carolina. I'm here. Great. Emma Jamilet. I'm here. Gabriela Nicole. Sí, Present. Harrison Antonio. I'm here. Ingrid Jamilet. Present. Irma Raquel. I guess Irma was there. Irma. Where are you, Irma? I saw you here. Present. Excellent. There you go. Okay. Jaime Oswaldo. Present. José Samuel. Present. Okay. Juliana Berkeley. You said you're having Present. problems, right? Ah, uh, there you are. I can listen. Present. Okay, don't worry. Se escucha. Yes. Happy. Karen Yvette. Present. Present. Okay, excellent. Catherine Abigail. Present. Catherine Alicia. Present. Katia Elizabeth. Present. Kelly Magdalena. I'm here. Excellent. Marina del Carmen. Ok, Marina, I guess she's not here. Marvin Raimundo. I'm here. Nereida Patricia. Present. Stacy Nicole. I'm here. Wendy de Carmen. Present. Present. Jancy Andrea. I'm here. And Zaira Jamilet. Present. Okay, did I mention the whole class? Am I missing somebody? A todos los mencioné, ¿sí? Sí, ¿verdad? Ok, so, let's discuss this one, ¿ok? We were talking about jobs and occupations. What are we going to do, class? I need you to help me out. Quiero que me ayude, ¿ok? We are going to identify. Here we go. We have picture one, two, and three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, ten, eleven. So, what are we going to do? We are going to get together in groups, and I want you to identify, for example, number one, number one. What is the correct vocabulary or the correct word for this picture? Police officer. Police officer. 
police officer. What letter it is? ¿Qué letra pone? J. J. Okay. Police officer. So, les comparto las palabras, las imágenes y en cinco minutos, five minutes, discutimos cuál es lo correcto, ¿ok? Write it down. ¿Cómo se va a ver en su cuaderno? Number one, two, three, four. Y a la par, la letra. ¿Está clara la indicación, clase? Yes. Yeah. Yes, yes. Ok, here we go. Yeah. Ahorita se los envío a WhatsApp. Don't worry. Primero unámonos a la sección. Here we go. Ok, go. Let's practice. Let's go. Very good. Who's missing to join? Okay. Excellent. I'm just missing Emma, Irma, and Kelly. I'm just missing Kelly. Excellent job, class. I'm going to send you the pictures right now. Very good. Okay, now you can go and check WhatsApp, okay? Let's discuss a speaking practice. Okay. Very good job. Okay. Okay, speaking practice. Um, the first one I... Okay, now you can go and check what's up. There you're going to find the picture, okay? And please, speaking time. I wanna listen to you practicing. Speaking, speaking please. En cameras on, ah, pero si están chequeando tal vez es porque se les apaga, ¿verdad? Pero si no, cameras on all the time, please. Excellent. No se estaba pensando. No, oh, sí. Es... Ajá. Server, es cierto. Server. Number six. Era N, ¿verdad? Server. <ríe> si no está en llamada, no creo. Server. Sí. Number five is letter. Don't forget to practice your English. Chef, letter D. Uh, number six is letter D. Yes. Uh, chef. Um, sí. Oku. Yes. Uh -huh. Chef. Number seven is. El from this clear. Mm. Será no, no. Yes, el 10 es ese. 
El from the square. Ajá, es cierto. Sí, el 10 sería from the square. El 10. Entonces, el number 8 sería a contact. Digo yo. No sé qué dicen ustedes. Office manager. La 8 sería a contact. Eh, office manager. ¿En inglés? Oh, oh, ah. No, no, no. Sería um, number, number nine. Number nine is a... Office manager. Office manager. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Office manager. And number eight is count. Okay, did you finish? No. You didn't finish? Okay. So, here we go. No, but it's time already. Ya era tiempo. Cuatro segundos y todos regresan. Four seconds. Y vienen ya todos. Class, did you finish? No. You didn't. But why? What's the speaking yes. time? <laughs> How much time do you need? ¿Cuánto tiempo más necesitan? One or two minutes? No. Five no. more? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Why? But okay. If not, let's do this. We are going to finish with this one. Pensé que cinco van a ser suficientes, no? Okay, so next time I promise I'm going to give you more time. Okay. This is speaking practice. Everybody needs to talk and please. Okay, in there we go. So pictures. We don't have all the pictures. Remember, we are still missing. Aquí nos van a hacer falta unas cuantas pictures. Now so here we go. Let me see. For example, number one is letter J. J. How about number two? Number two. I have a man who's driving a taxi. Yes. Letter O. 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 Where is it? Letter O. 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 Are you sure? Driver. Yes. O. O. Yes. O. Yes. Oh, wait, let me change the color. No me gusta. Pongamos el red. Oh, exactly. He's a taxi driver. Taxi driver. Very good job. So we already have taxi driver. Let's continue. take a look at number three. Number three, look at this man. What is he doing? Is he a salesperson or a vendor? He. P. Letter P. Letter P. 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 As in yes. potato. P. Ah, okay. P. Porque yo escuché B. No. P. 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 Exactly. So we call this man a vendor. There you go. Por eso hacía la aclaración antes. Number four. Number four. L. Cell person. So what is it? Little L. 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 What is she selling? Or what is she trying to sell? What is she selling? Mm -hmm. Any idea? Look at the picture. Is a food? Um, is she a salesperson? Okay, you say salesperson. Let's find out. I'm just listening to you, class. No, 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 no,
I don't know. Veamos si nos hace falta después. Continue. Number five. Look at this man. Number five. Little Ann Herber. Herber, right? And do you remember? We were watching the video and he had another uh, name. This child has another way to be called. Waiter. Oh, waiter. Very good. Oh, in this case, server. Let's continue. Letter N, it's over. Number six. Letter D. Chairs. Tell me. Eh, en la cuatro, eh, yo considero que es host, que es como anfitriona, porque están como en un restaurante. Okay. Yeah, because it's weird. That's why I was asking you. Yo pregunté, ¿qué le está vendiendo? Ustedes me dijeron, sabemos. Entonces, ¿qué es cost? Yes, class. Is G. Eh, la cuatro sería G. Okay, so no, it's not salesperson. It's not letter L. So, uh oh, wait, let me go back. Control C. Ah, so letter four. G. G. Any other opinion? Yes. G. Hust. Hust. Very good. Letter G. Hust. If you have a party in your house, you are the host. Si tienen, un, digamos, un cumpleaños en su casa y todos los invitados vienen a su casa, ustedes son el host. Así se la llama. Entonces creería que exacto. Estamos bien ahí. Host. Number six. Look at this. Number six. D. D. Letter D. Letter D. Letter D. Letter D. D. Are you sure? Yes. The chef is iPhone. <laughs> ah, yes, right. I was wrong. I was confused, you know? I was looking to this woman. Estaba viendo a ella, pero no, tienen razón. Aquí está el seis. So that's right. Very good job. Number six is letter D. Seven. Seven. Eight. Section A. Eight. Sorry? Letter K. Letter K. Letter A. Number seven is letter K. Receptionist. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Letter F. Ah. Letter number F. eight. Number eight. Number seven. Uh -huh. Number seven. And number seven. This letter F. I don't think so. Mm -mm. Bien, quiero que vean el number seven and number ten. Number seven and number ten. Ahí va a ser la respuesta. ¿Quién es quién? Number ten is from the floor. Oh, okay. Number ten. Excellent, Emma. Number ten is the front desk clerk. Les explicaba en dónde podemos encontrar al front desk clerk. Los hoteles pero veamos entonces number seven miren la imagen es totalmente diferente number seven qué está haciendo el number seven what is he doing he's taking a call he has a computer he's writing huh? that is an office so exactly number seven is letter k very good job Okay. Number eight. Number A. A. Hmm? A. 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 As an apple. A. A. Very A. good. Very good job. Number nine. 
Office manager. Office manager. Office manager. Take a look at her face. Miren esa cara. Office manager. Wow, she's staring. Right? She's not happy today. Office manager. Very good job. So, number 10, Emma. Yes, Emma, where is number 10? Uh, from letter? the floor. From the square. Very good job. So, letter F. Um, next one. Uh, look at this. 11 is uh -huh. B. 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 Very good. B. L. B. Ok, any opinion? ¿Alguien que quiera hacer algún cambio o estamos bien ahí? Estamos bien, ¿verdad? So, which ones are we missing? ¿Cuáles nos sobran? Security guard. Security guard. Security guard. Guard. Very good. So, do you have the same? Tenemos lo mismo, clase? Yes? Yes. Yes? Yes. Okay. So, let me see. What time is it? Yeah, we still have time. Let's continue. Let's continue. Wait, let me do something real quick. Don't forget your microphones, okay? Please. So let's have the last part. Is this one? We were missing five more. So I guess this is easier now. Está más fácil. Tenemos a hospital and a store, clothing store. So for example, we are still missing number 12. What do we have uh, in number 12? Letter H. Nurse. Nurse. Okay. Nurse, exactly. He is a nurse. And then we have next to him, we have the letter Doctor. E. Doctor. 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 Letter e. 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 If we move to the last picture, we have. 14, 15, and 16. Look at this uh, lady. She's looking at a suit. Or she's selling a suit. Está vendiendo un traje. So, what is she? Salesperson. There you go. Salesperson. What letter is it? L. L. Muy bien. 15. We have the lady in red. And she's giving Let a package see. and she's getting some money. So she is. Uh, she's cashier. Exactly. Uh -huh. What letter is it? Cashier. Letter C. Letter C. There you go. And the last one we have this man who's taking care of vendors and people who is inside of the store. How do we call him? Dear M. M. Security guard. Security guard. Excellent. So he mm. takes care of people inside of the store. Okay, so very good. Questions about vocabulary, please. Questions about vocabulary. Or maybe about pronunciation. Yes, questions? Class, is it clear? Yes. yes. Are you sure? La letra G. Okay. Letter G. How do you pronounce letter G? Host. Yes. Host. Remember that in English, letter H, it has a sound. In English, it suena. Entonces sería Host. 
Host. Okay. Okay. Jimmy. Thank you. You're welcome. Any other? La que, que, que esa no es una profesión, pero el que está en la ciudad de ruedas, ¿cómo se dice? El paciente. ¿Qué estás ahí? When you go ¿Cómo? to a hospital, cuando ustedes van al hospital, ¿cómo les decimos? Es, no sé, diría peaceful, paciente. No, no peaceful, no, nada que ver. Hay días, ¿qué Ok, five minutes, to look it up. Un minuto para que me digan la respuesta correcta. Vamos. Look it up, buscámoslo. But great observation, excellent. Patient. 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 Exactly. Patient. 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 Ok. Letter M. Creo que la M. Tenemos que repetirlo un poquito. Security. Security. Guard. Security. Guard. 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 And this one. Front desk clerk. Exacto. Es las K suenan bastante. Desk. 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 Sales person. Mm -hmm. Va unida. Sales person. Sales person. Unida, ¿ok? Nunca separada. Sales person. <coughs> so, questions about this. Preguntas. Yes. yes. Are you sick? Yo tengo una consulta. ¿Ah? <laughs> If I'm sick. Ok, escuché, I'm sorry, can you repeat please? Eh, yo tengo una pregunta con respecto a la plataforma. Claro. Eh, en la sección 3, okay. eh, trata sobre el vocabulario que acabamos de ver. Exacto. Aparece lo que es sales, sales person y a cashier. Eh, sería, si es a cashier, pero me la da incorrecta. Ok, three point... Person? 3.2. For T y 15. Ok, excellent. Let's find out. Veámoslo ahorita. Para eso estamos en la clase. 3.2. Here we go. Let me share. Ahorita comparto. We still have like two minutes. Uh, which one, Samuel? Five, seven. Ok. 14 and 15. 14. Aquí estamos. And. 15. What is job? Yeah. 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 Number 16. Mm -hmm. She is a cashier. Mm -hmm. yeah, she is. Fifteen, yes, a cashier. Now it's is it correct now? It's correct. Very good. Okay, you know this exercise. Because of the time. Este ejercicio lo vamos a hacer mañana. ¿sí? De nombrar ya a las personas. Ahorita solo era vocabulary practice. 
déjenme enviarles la última parte del ejercicio para que puedan practicar el vocabulary. Mañana vamos con oraciones ya. Oración. He is. He is. He is. Okay. So. Pregunta, chicos. Ahí estamos ya con el complemento. Yeah. Questions? Vamos a hacer ese ejercicio mañana, ¿ok? So, please, I need you to stay here in every class, ¿ok? To come on time, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, ¿ok? Mañana resolvemos esa actividad para que ustedes ya puedan complementar la semana, ¿ok? So, si no hay más preguntas, class. No? So, thank you so much for joining this class. We are going to stop the class here. Have a great night. You did a great job today, okay? Hicieron un buen trabajo. So, practice the vocabulary. Keep on practicing, okay? So, see you tomorrow, class. See you tomorrow. Have a great night. Good night, teacher. Good night, Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night to you, my class. Good night to you. Good night. Good night to you.